Hey, um, if you could turn around, tell me where you want me to put this. Oh, sh look at that. Um, well, can you... Oh, there's really nowhere to put it, is there? I guess bring it down, uh, right there. Um, what are you doing, bringing home the, the... There's three huge cargo containers on this, and also, there's, like, no gyroscopes or anything that, uh, as far as I can tell, anything that was, like, that would have, me, like, uh, prevent me from taking control of it. So this is just, like, a huge, awesome, kind of... So you just, you just stole that ship. Yeah, the, and the only damage to it is removing the two parachute things that were kind of throwing off my uh, landing trajectory, well, and the bring, one door, bring and then the, uh, what's that called, the top, some glass plating. Yeah. It's, um, that's a clunky ship. You know what that is? That's the B-60 bulk freighter you could buy at the store. It's like the basic version. That thing's got a, um... A couple of things with it, but our grinders are cutting it up right now. Oh no, I've successfully captured it. <laughs> yeah, our grinders are cutting up because uh, because you don't own it. I don't think. All the way. Hold on. Let's see if we could fix that. Because this is a good ship to maybe convert into something. Yeah, this is nice. I love this. Well, it seems right. like you own it. Hold on. It's owned by you. Yeah, we're definitely losing power. I think the thing. I just, just yeah, I just turned power off. Oh wait. Can you share with your faction? Can you jump in there uh, and sl select all of the items in the uh, in the K menu? Select everything. And then share with your faction, because right now you own it, I think. Cool. Well, this is a civilian ship. It's not going to be worth a damn in a fight. But um, I could use this to to go back and forth to make rounds if we need to. This is a perfect ship to do that. You can load this thing up with everything you need. I just wanna I wanna dock it up with uh, with our base somehow, so I gotta make some room over here and, and see what I can do. Free freighter. <laughs> we got a freighter. Jeez, he made it easy. You know what it is though? I think I did put easy takeovers on. So that's that's probably why. Okay. That's yeah, fine, that's the though. first time I've ever seen that, so that's that's cool. Yeah, I think the ship build printer is built. I mean, if anything, this could be more of a disposable one if need be. Uh, the only thing that's the issue... Uh, well, I don't know if we can... How to fix that? There's the, a glass plating that I broke off in the front to just get in. Yeah, it's okay. There's some kind of storm happening right now. Which is terrible. Alright. Dude, I got it. I got it to set up a shuttle job. This thing's gonna be sweet. It's gonna work for us. It needs a new paint job, but that's okay. Hey, you paint it however you want. I think you can paint it. I have no idea how to fix this. I'm not I'm never breaking glass again. <laughs> Let me see what you're dealing with here. Uh, okay. Well, I do have a good idea. Let's go take that thing out for a spin. And go pick up that cargo container. Oh yeah. Do you want me to drive, or do you want to drive it? Oh, I'd like to drive. Okay. The honor is all of yours. It looks like it's actually working now for the blue. Oh yeah, look at that. I can see the color scheme you're going for. I have to say, I like it. Do, do, do. I will finish uh, 
calling her in that bad boy soon. Well, Captain, I'm gonna sit over here in the chair and I'm gonna let you do your thing. Do do look at you go. We are going in the right direction, right? <laughs> oh yeah, yep. You'll okay. see it uh, right ahead of us, a little bit left, the green patch of grass. Oh, okay. There we go. It's taking time for it loaded. Okay. When you hover above the um, crate in question, we'll try to lock it on the landing gear. Looking good. I wish I could see, like, I wish there was, like, an option for me to, like, move around the ship with my camera. Yeah, there is. In fact, if you, I think it's alternate or control. If you hold that down and move your mouse around, you might be able to... Oh, yeah. Oh, that is huge help. Not a lot of room there, so we may have to invent something to help us out. We got a junk Ajax M6 patrolling at 2.61 kilometers. Then we have the Mulberry Trading Junker at 5.76 kilometers. We got to get our job done and get the F out of here. Those PDCs at our base will protect us. All right. Bring it in uh, a little bit to your right. Wait, I'm going to make sure I'm understanding. Yeah, right. You're right. Uh, hold on. You're going to hit the wreckage. Why don't we... Um, why don't you swing the, the front of your ship closer? Yep, swing it closer. I'm going to get creative here. Because I don't think you're going to be able to bring it in at close enough. There's just not enough room. So I'm going to make a little tail. To stick out. Hold it right there. Okay. Alright. Hit P. Okay. I think you got it. Are you hitting the space bar? Uh, no. Okay, wait. That was... Again. No, don't hit P again. Hit P and then space bar. Lift. Oh, don't hit P again. Oh. Come down. Come down. Down. Down there. Hit P. Don't touch P. And get altitude. Lift. You got it. You got it. Just keep it away from the wreckage. I'm going to get back in the ship. Nice. Ooh, this thing is. All right, use the uh, Q and E. Level us out. Use the horizon indicator. Yeah. Uh, I just heard an explosion. You killed the cargo. No. <laughs> 
The entire cargo shit. Oh my god, the entire. Yep, it's gone. It's all gone. Oh. So. I just moved a little bit and it just. <sighs> <sighs> it's all gone. You. Oh my god, it's all gone. I can't believe it. Can we recover that? No, it's the the cargo container's been destroyed. If it's if if it's destroyed, no, I can't. Ah. Pain, the <laughs> pain. I'm no. Oh my god. It's 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 I'm gone. Sorry. I th I think it's I think it's a hundred percent gone. I don't even know. Uh. That thing completely threw me off when I was moving. I... Oh my god. I'm gonna fly over to see if anything survived. There's components everywhere. Not a lot of... There's... I mean, there aren't a lot of components. Most of the said components are gone. I'm I'm very sorry. Frick. Oh well, this is uh, this when you learn sometimes you gotta learn the hard way, right? So much good stuff in there. Well a lot of armor plating. Yeah, if you bring the ship closer I'll empty my inventory of what I've got. Well oh, there's a lot of motors too, superconductors. Um Yeah. Oh, wait. I just thought of a fantastic idea. Junk mulberry. You're, uh... Only temporary, mind you. But I'm put... I'm gonna cut into this cargo container a little bit. All good. I'm gonna build a build and repair system so it automatically picks this stuff up for us. Oh, that's genius. Alright, I'll tell you what I need. I need 120 construction components. I think I can. Uh, do I have that? Yeah, you should. I got them. 120 construction components. I got I need 60. 25 and oh, 2 plates. All is not lost. Okay. Build and repair system. Use conveyors, yes. Fly mode, yes. Weld before grind, yes. Help others. Janitor, janitor, janitor. Picking it up. Dude! Yes! You can hit the switch lock again on your on your hot bar. For the landing gear. That's it. Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh wait, what if we go over here? Will it start eating that stuff up? No, because we have it on walk mode. Oh. Yeah, we're doing that on purpose because this is a cargo ship, not a salvage repair ship. If that makes sense. Yeah. And my friend, you have done it. 
Now you just gotta learn to fly your ship. It will fly differently under load. So the more cargo that's on it, the heavier it will kind of act and it'll be sluggish and slow. You may lose altitude. So I guess what you want to look at is that um, bubble in the right hand corner of your screen there shows your level to what, what gravity is. And uh, on the screen in front of you is the horizon. On the right hand side you'll also see the uh, energy output and your fuel uh, s reserves. 86%. Yep. At the top of your HUD you should be seeing um, um, some data about our base and things of that, of that nature. Which is fine. So yeah. Um I think the answer is gonna be no. This thing is too big. Wouldn't you say? I mean you're standing underneath of it, right? Yeah, it's, it's like it's it's up. there isn't really enough room. <laughs> um I could probably like build a little platform for it. I, a little platform. Like, just a, a flat space to, to land it on. We're going to need a Jibungus platform probably over to uh, to the right of the ship. So, starboard of, of, of the ship. And it's probably going to be out the side of that hill. So, all right. I just needed to see it for myself to see what comparison of how this thing will look yeah if it's like I could see that that should be big enough question mark Should I fill in this thing entirely, or I should leave a space for, I'm assuming, where the connector would be to the... Um, I, I think what I want to do is fill it in completely and put the ship on it, center it, and then see where the connector is on the ship and where it would line up on the platform. So it looks symmetrical when the ship is sitting here. Ah, okay. I don't know. I, I kind of I get OCD about it. Like I like things and they look good. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, it makes sense. Is then uh, we can easily. I think it's just one block. We'll just have to cut it. That's Made all. Made the castle run in under twelve parsecs. Not really. Is <laughs> it? No. There's a lies and slander that. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe. 1200 parsecs. 100 parsecs. What is a parsec anyway? It's interesting because multiple accounts show different things where it's like one's a measurement of speed and then the other one's a measurement of, uh, like, space, like. Oh, it just barely makes it. Yeah, one's a measurement of distance, the other one's a measurement of time. But it's like... What is that, like, beeping? Beeping? I hear, like, a boom, boom. That is the shield. That's a thing of beauty. Here we go. All of those components are gonna link up to the rest of the system. In a couple of seconds. It's beautiful. Glorious. It's a series of tubes. It sure is. That's it. Ship is connected. Oh. Oh. Heck 
Yeah. Dude, it's it's this is a big ship. God darn, it's huge. I love it. I'm so happy I stole it. Huh. Um to your left a little bit. A little more. A little more. Almost. There, oh, oh, oh. there we go. She's jumping. Bring her down. Yeah. It's yellow. Perfect. Green. There we go. Yeah. All right. I think the stairs are lined up perfectly. We're almost they are. perfectly. Almost. Almost. It'll do. But. Oh, oh yeah. It works. That's like spot on though. Check that out. Yeah. That's, uh, you don't get a better connection than that. Holy smokes. That's... It's legit. Like, all the way around, too. That's mm -hmm. awesome. Ah, this is beautiful. Well, I guess all that's left to do is to program it to fly automatically to a place. Just double check that. Yeah, fuel is at that. 92? Yeah, 92. Which is more than before. It was like 86 last time I remembered. Yeah, that's because uh, it just set it up. So we're going to record path and set home. So first things first. We are recording. This is connector one was set. Perfect. So we're going to turn engines on. Systems on. Ready to undock. Verify I'm not going to take the thing out with me. Slide out, slide up. Clear the landing area. Making a turn. I find my target, there it is. There we go. Back up a tiny bit. I think. We're there? Yeah, that looks good. Starboard connector. I'm gonna say lock. And stop recording. Yeah, it's green. All right. We're there. Perfect. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. We're here. Oh, man, that is sick. Autopilot is activated. This thing is great. Oh, outpost. It's not crashed. It's just actually on the ground. Oh, it's landed. Yeah. Dude, I'm thought, leave, I'm leaving without you. I'm leaving without you. It, automatically. Sorry. It is a okay. This thing is. This place is beat up pretty bad, though. Dude. Shame. My hands are off the controls. This is flying itself. That's awesome. <laughs> Dude, the the bulk freighter is flying itself.
It is shuttling like a champion among champions. This, it, it all comes down to this. If this program works, then we've completely eliminated the need for a pilot on this big ship. Oh, we are so close. Silicon ore. Dude, it did it. It's landed successfully. We. Oh my god, that was so good. Is ice more valuable to us or would iron be? Uh, ice. Ice, okay. Dude, it's we're there. We're we're freaking landed. And the stairs right exactly where we put them. Oh wow. That was spectacular. <laughs> <laughs>